<laughs> You're overdoing it now. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I, I may have licked the pages. You're fucked. That's all I'm saying. You're fucked. He's just a horny teenager, isn't it? Did, did you not clean this up before you came? Why am I gonna clean it? It's your place. So you dick it. It's not my place, mate. <laughs> It's our studio in Canary Wolf. Welcome back to the podcast. Thank you guys for staying with us, staying patient. Yeah, yeah. So um, why are they patient? They don't need to be. I mean, you don't need to watch this. <laughs> no but one's if, forcing you. But if you're here, we love you. And we want to say thank you to yeah. all of you guys because uh, you're the real ones. Uh, today, Julian, just before we start off the podcast, I got yeah. some uh, a little game. Go on. Uh, as you guys don't know... Uh, Proddy White is not here in the house today. <laughs> oh, yeah. He couldn't make it from <laughs> Stoke on Trent. Yeah. Proddy, Proddy White is basically the guy who helps us with... Um, microphone, camera, camera set up. Camera set up. He even comes up with a couple of ideas, yeah, games. He's the producer, basically, yeah. but without the financial. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you know someone... He's basically giving, um, giving us moral support. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah, so he came up with a game the other day where he shows us and pictures. And he also, he also disses us. Like, sometimes after podcast, he would literally say, nah, this one was shit, man. Oh, oh yeah. shit! He did say that, innit? Yeah, yeah. But, we but then, but then, when it's good, he tells us it's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. But this is why we oh, need someone like Proddy yeah, White. Yeah. Wait, this is why everyone in their lives need someone like Proddy White in their life because you can't just have someone coming up to you and always saying like, you're a "Yes, sick. man." A you're yes, a man. A yes, man. A yes, man. Bro, I can't stand that shit. I because feel like you're my yes, man. I'm not your yes, man. When I when so, you, so either I'm really sick at everything I do yeah. or you're a yes man which one is it please tell me how I'm a yes man when I'm the one who always tells you fucking do this fucking do that get back on your YouTube videos get back on your Instagram yeah, videos yeah YouTube is dead we don't we yeah. d- uh, I don't know man the YouTube's been a long time since I lost you're it. a yes man though every time I do music when have you ever said nah this one's because shit? it's actually bangers uh, okay that's it <laughs> it's actually okay, bangers that's it. so last week probably why I came up with a game where he shows us some images yeah. and wants us to know whether, uh, and then uh, we have to guess what the images are and are, are they are they basically like 90s stuff right 90s stuff yeah, yeah. It's something from our childhood basically yeah, yeah, which yeah. will be 90s in some cases, cases and 70s in some cases <laughs> I think yeah. okay. I'm like a nah. couple of years older nah, than so you I, yeah, cool. So um, I've got a few images here, Julian. Yep. Um, spend a lot of uh, hard work finding them. I've got uh, them for you, yeah. and I want you to guess what they are, okay? Uh, cool. First image. That's an MP3 player, bro. That's it. Did you ever have an MP3 yeah, player? Yeah, of course. Did Those you? were the times. Did you know how to put music on it first? Because when it first came out, yeah. it was like a new thing, and I, I didn't know how to use it. I knew everybody had them in school, yeah, yeah, but yeah. I didn't know how to actually what, put music what on it. What were they again? There was like 128 megabytes. There was 500 and something megabytes. Yeah, yeah, but you could put up to 1,000 songs, I think. It probably really depends because how back big then it was. Ba- it was no, the smaller ones no, where you couldn't. Back then, they didn't measure it by um, uh, the size. They didn't say GB or MB. They used to say 1,000 songs. No, bro. Well, yes, on. they did. No. No, they, I no. swear they did. No, it was like 128 MB, then 500 something MB, but you never got gigs. I've been lied to my entire the life. MP3 players with gigs came like years later. Oh, gigs took time. No, but didn't you measure them? You, I think you measured them in your own head as but like. I didn't know that's a fucking 10 year old kid. What? The how many songs you can put? Yeah. There was a loophole, bro. There's a loophole. Oh. You know, some of them people think you can only put like hundred. So- oh, you had to compress the file, didn't it, or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I remember where we we one of my MP3 players, you can only put like fifty songs or something. But I used to be able to put like two hundred and fifty songs. Oh, okay. Because I used to compress it and then make it into another format and shuffle. Oh. WMA, I think. WMA. WMA. Files. WMA. That's yeah. the one. And then you extract it. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Long, long thing. Yeah. Next thing. Okay, next oh one. yes Oh how can I forget the name bro Fuck Is that um, powder thing And then you just open it And you go Oh bro it, Wait wait I know the name I know the name I know the name Have you got the name right now I know uh, the name I know the name Don't it, tell me Don't tell me I don't know I don't think these are names It says Eichenzong No 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 They're called the Oh wait no that's Sherbet the... or something Oh yeah Sherbet yeah, Sherbet Sherbet, yeah. Sherbet yeah. and little straws That's the thing isn't yeah, it Yeah yeah Have you Cool two out of two How did you eat these by the way you see the top yeah if you press the one, one the, the thin side the sealed bit yeah the sealed bit if you press it sideways it yeah. opens up and then you and then you, and then you just you just <laughs> you what do you do huh what how do you eat it how okay you're 10 year old julian yeah. here uh cool how do you eat it so i open it i press the thing yeah i usually get like my phone yeah and then i put it here <laughs> <laughs> that's how I hate it. No, you can't do that, man. Like <laughs> no, but have you tried? You tell me how you. Know you, you tell me how you. Ate. You know. You, you know. tell me. Show me. No, but you know. Don't what? even tell me. Show me. Okay. Put the mic down. Uh, uh, how show I? Me. How I ate it? Yeah. One. <laughs> it's 
You're overdoing it now. And sometimes it got stuck in it. Yeah, yeah. So like. That's how I used Mad. to. That's how Mad. I used to eat it. Mad. But anyway, you know the first time when he did it. Yeah. Do it again one more time on the seaside. I just want to ask you saying. You see the <laughs> straws? They're that small. Yeah. You're meant to hold it like this. Why are you holding it like this? <laughs> oh, because I. Had, like that. I you had, have to go. Like, if anything, like. No, but I had loads of them. In oh, my so hand. you'd pull. I had, I had like twenty in my hand, and I went like this. Oh shit, man. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This one. <laughs> Floppy disk, innit? it? Okay, so yeah. w- w- what's your experience with the floppy disk? Floppy disks was mainly for documents, innit? it? I don't think you could put this music in that. Nah, but this was well, no. What well, I, I remember is documents. You can put files on it, no? Yeah, files, documents. Oh, documents. I, I don't remember like. No, but you know, back in the days when we, when I had a computer, mm. uh, the games used to come in a floppy disk, so we could oh, play yeah, floppy yeah, disk yeah, games. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then actually, we, one of my things uh, I'll talk about after. Oh, is it? My, but this was the gold before the USB. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. when the USB came out, everybody yeah. was so gas. Oh, USB, I've got USB. Yeah, yeah. You'd buy a USB even though you didn't need it. So I had to used to carry one on my keys. And these, I um, mean, like Asda used to get like a pack of 10 or something, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, shit. You know, this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This was was, you know this shit, yeah? What I, is it? What did they tell the audience? It's what is? obviously um, bubblegum, innit? Mm. But the flavor was so nice. But not it's any bubble gum. Why is it? Why is this unique bubble gum? Why is, is it question. unique? Because it tastes nice. That's what I remember. Nah, bro, this is in a fucking toothpaste. Oh shit. yeah, 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 yeah. So Say that. You, oh yeah. Last one, you're gonna laugh. Yeah. Pokemon cards, isn't it? Yeah. Do you still have Pokemon cards? I I know why you use this as your fifth one because you want you want to have your fucking little ten minutes to talk about all your Pokemon cards yeah. that you're collecting right yeah. now. Can, can I on. show them? Go wait. Can I show them? Oh, you've got them. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. Right. I don't have them. Go on, speak. Nah, but it. so the funny story behind Pokemon cards. Yeah, when I saw this, yeah, all, all I remembered was in the town where I'm from, back in Denmark, a lot of the shops didn't sell Pokemon cards. You had to go to these big stores to get them, right? Supermarkets yeah. to get them. So all my boys, uh, friends at uh, work, uh, uh, school, sorry, they used to get them from like uh, supermarkets. Yeah. I didn't have any, but we we'll know what we used to do instead. Yeah. You know, calling cards. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, back yeah. in the calling yeah, cards, yeah, yeah. my mom used to go through like three or four <laughs> well, weeks. To call back home. To call stuff. back home, yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I used to use those. So I used to take them to school, yeah, yeah, yeah. and take them. Obviously, they laughed at me, <laughs> come back. And then eventually, my yeah. dad felt bad and we yeah. went to the supermarket and, bought, and bought got them. the whole box for me, yeah. yeah. But that's a funny story, that one is. Let me see if I've got any more images for you. Uh, Talking then, of calling cards, yeah, yeah, I've got a funny story for you, yeah. Go on. Same shit. I remember my mom used to obviously make me go to the shop to buy calling cards because back then, that's how we used to talk back home. Innit? We used to scratch they were priced like five pound calling card, ten pound calling and then card. Yeah. Five pounds you can speak for ten minutes, or whatever it yeah, is, yeah. however minutes it was. Yeah. So I, th- this is what happened. My mom was like, "Oh, I want you to go buy this card from the Tamil shop." Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, "Which one is that?" And she said, "Tokom." Yeah. <laughs> listen, listen. She said, "Go buy me the Tokom card." Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Tokom. Tokom. Yeah. Tokom. Okay. Listen, listen. Uh, she said, "Go Funny buy the Tokom card." Yeah. I go to the shop yeah. and I'm like, oh, uh, can I have the Tokom card, yeah? Yeah. And then the guy's bare looking at me like, which card? Which card? I said, it's a calling card. You can call back home and stuff, yeah? Yeah, yeah. You can call like India, Sri Lanka and stuff, yeah? And so like, what's the name you of the card? You said Sri Lanka. Yeah, but then let's let's be honest, yeah? If I'm going to buy a card, I can't go up to him <laughs> and say, can I buy the card to call Tamil Lulam? Because nah, they, they if it's not know. a Tamil man, he's not going to know. Yeah, yeah. So th- we have to leave certain things. We but can't then, bring it but in. Then everywhere. that goes to show that you don't care about it. You need to educate people. It also goes to show okay, that I was out, fucking like cut fifteen cut years cut old. This out. Yeah, Unnecessary yeah. shit. Yeah. Now so, we can keep it in this Yeah. Fine. So um, yeah. So yeah, I go there and then he kept going like, "Are you sure?" And then he's showing me all these cards. Yeah. yeah. He's like, "Is it this?" And I'm like, "Nah, that's not." Oh Tokom. yeah, because you don't know what the card looks like. Yeah. You only know Tokom. Yeah. So I'm like looking for the word Tokom on it. I'm like, I don't see it. And then after a while, yeah, I'm like staring at it and I'm like, "Wait a second. And then there's this one card. <laughs> wait, wait. There's this one Don't card. Don't tell me it was something else. No, no, no. There was this one card. Yeah, yeah. Because they only had like five cards where you can call back to Sri Lanka yeah, yeah, and stuff. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, he showed me, yeah. I'm like, I think it's this one, yeah. Guess what it was called? What? Imagine what it could be. Togo home. Togo. To- talk home. Talk home. Or oh, talk home. Yeah. What did your mom say? Talk home. Talk home. No, she probably, she was just like she was just like get, she was like tokom tokom card tokom card. You yeah? know what? Yeah, there's yeah. so many words similar to that yeah, that yeah, happens yeah. all the time. Yeah, Fuck yeah. me. Fuck tokom. <laughs> is that is tokom still around? Bro, I don't know. I don't even know if calling cards still around. Uh, I, they do exist actually. Now they do exist. They do yeah. exist. That's how like a mobile made their fortune, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, do you know what this is? Yeah, fucking VHS tape. Yeah. Do you know what this is? Is it just a robotic car? A play? Like something you play it's with? It's not a fucking car, bruv. It's a dog. <laughs> Sorry. It's a, <laughs> it's a dog. 
I don't even know why I said car. I don't even know why I said car. Yeah, so but is it like a toy for kids? Yeah, Robo Dog. Yeah, you don't know Robo Dog? Nah. Everyone had a Robo Dog back in the days. When you say everyone, do you mean everyone in your house? <laughs> no, I said like all the kids. Were they, were they, are you talking about all the rich kids in your neighborhood I wasn't in Denmark? Rich. I wasn't rich. You're a rich I, neighborhood in Denmark. Yeah, everyone had Robo Dog. Is it the rich neighborhood in Denmark? I'm not. Or sure. are you talking about South Faro? Because <laughs> I don't Farrow. think in South Faro everyone had Robo Dog. No, but, but you know like how um. Beyblades, for example. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they became a thing and everybody yeah. had them poor. Yeah, but these rich. you can't bring them to school, though. Beyblades, yeah. you could. Oh, I used to bring them to school. We're in not Denmark allowed to, or here? In Denmark. We're not allowed to bring toys to school. Bro, who brings toys to school? Unless it's small toys, like marbles or Beyblades. You don't have, like, a toy show-off day where you, like, you tell you, uh, you bring a toy from home and then you talk about the toy and why it means so much to you. <laughs> Did you not do that? <laughs> to be honest, it might have happened. Maybe I forgot. Maybe I forgot. Now, let me get. Let me dig into your memory. Yeah. They, you bring something from home, a yeah. toy or like an item, yeah. and because we're kids, obviously, yeah. it's always going to be toys, isn't it? Yeah. And you talk about it to the class. Nah, not that I remember of. So, where, was this in Denmark or here? Come to think of it, it's not here, not in this yeah. fucking country. This country don't even fucking homework is here. Right, right? cool. Wait. Last item, please. Oh, you. St- how many do you have, bro? We said five. No, nah, but I didn't think you were going to get them right in it. Tam- I just saw it. Tamagotchi. Yeah. yeah. Did yeah. you have one? Yeah, yeah. So of everyone course, had these. I had one in France. Di- All the lights, even that light. Hello, yo, 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 yo. Oh, that's Snoopy. Yeah, yeah. I know Snoopy. So what did you do? Like, did you watch games? Or, um, did you play games or did you watch Snoopy? I never met Snoopy. <laughs> I don't ask you if you met him. I said, did you watch him on like cartoon? Oh, cartoon. Or did Charlie's, you play games? Because uh, it was games as well, Snoopy the, the, games. Mm, I remember watching the cartoon and his owner is Charlie Brown, isn't it? I don't remember that much. All I remember is Snoopy. If you can get fucking Snoopy up, yeah. you can get Charlie Brown up. That's the guy's... The, 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 the kid with the yellow shirt. I forgot, bro. Okay, that's, that's a dumb yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's a dumb one, then, if you don't remember. I'm testing you, though. You're not testing me. Yeah, well, you don't even know the other I, characters. It doesn't matter. All right, whatever, bro. You ready next, for the next yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, whatever. There's a phone in it. Of course, it's a phone. Yeah, Do you remember yeah. this, though? I remember this phone, yeah. Yeah. And this phone, and another one, like yeah. another shape... They used to be so popular back in the days. This and only like rich people had them. Like wealthy people had these phones. Na- but come to think nah, of it nah, now. Nah. Uh, wealthy for a while. But after a certain amount of years, like two, three years, yeah. it became a thing where everyone in school h- could yeah. afford it. Yeah, yeah, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I still remember when I was allowed my first phone. It was in year eight, yeah? When I was like, my dad you wanted... You were allowed a phone in year eight? No, my dad wanted me to have one just for the sake of like, because I used to walk home and stuff so oh, I could okay. keep him just updated Just to get and pedophiles shit, yeah? don't catch you. Exactly, bro. You don't, you know, yeah. fucking London and shit. Yeah, yeah. So just to be safe. And then he took me to the shop and he said like, oh, get a phone. Obviously, he's thinking, um, get something like... He just took you to the shop and said, no, choose no, your phone. Obviously not like fucking wow. an iPhone. Talk about privilege here, no, guys. Listen, wow. if, if anything, if we're going to talk about I privilege... I was just given a phone. If we're going to talk... No, it wasn't like that. It was Christmas, bro. Yeah. Oh, so Christmas, you get a brand new phone. No, bro. Listen, wow. don't try it. Don't try it. Don't Privilege. try it. Don't try it because I'm not even done. I'm not even done. He's He obviously gave me a small budget. Let's and see that phone again. Hold up. Yeah, carry on. He obviously gave me a small budget and he said, choose a phone, obviously, just for like uh, basic needs and stuff, yeah? Oh. And then for some reason, because like a couple of kids in my school had this and I wanted to start filming mm. using this, isn't it? Because yeah, this was one oh of the yeah, only camera. phones with a camera. Two megapixels. Yeah. And at the time, there was only three or four phones with cameras and this was one of them, yeah? Yeah, yeah. And I really wanted it for the sake of filming and shit, yeah? Mm-mm. And then I was like, oh, like, I want to get this. And then my dad's like, this isn't a phone. This is some square <laughs> shit. Like, <laughs> like, I'm telling you to update us and stuff, not yeah, to play around yeah, with yeah, it and yeah. stuff, innit? So I wasn't allowed. I didn't buy it. That's you the didn't story. Get it yet. So I'm not privileged, you bitch. <laughs> so it's a childhood story, trauma. Yeah. <laughs> is that why you're bringing it up now? You turned from privilege ah, to childhood shit. trauma. I'll take it back. Yeah. Do you want it now? I'll buy it for you. <laughs> nah, nah, Probably nah. 15 pounds now. Nah. Go on, next um, image. Uh, f- sadly, something you came up with as well. So we're not going to go into this. it. Oh, shit, that's mad. But I have. So you know me, I'm a bit different, right? The game was to bring five, five bring five um, images pictures, images yeah. to do with 90s technology or 90s things to yeah. like bring back memories yeah nostalgia yeah so you know me I'm different so two the next two things are not pictures they're sounds sounds yeah I want you to hear this sound and tell me what it is yeah okay go on are we gonna get copyrighted for it nah 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 so wait for the advert to finish we'll play I'll edit the audio I know this one nah nah hold up That's Pac-Man. No. It's an arcade game, isn't it? What is it called? Space Intruder. Space nah. Invader. Space Invader. Nah, Space nah. Invasion. Nah. Sp- 
Space Invasion. Nej, nej. Spade Invader. Nej. Spade Invasion. Nej. Suck my dick. Listen. You know the sound. I think you know the game. How does it look like? It's like a little... F- What is it on? Uh, Windows XP. Ah, you're getting close. So I think you do know it. Yeah. Show me the picture. Pinball Space Cadet. Pinball Space Pinball. Cadet. That's the one. Yeah. Ah... Oh shit! I used to yeah. play that. That's that. That's the game you play if you don't have internet. It was fun though. Yeah, it's I fun. To, I would still play it if I had it. I Is might it? get it on my phone. You know, they've got the phone versions now. Why don't you go to a real life arcade and a casino and play it? And get nah, money. it's better like when it's like on the phone. Well, you can win money this way. True, true. And, okay. We don't promote gambling, by the way. All right, so I got another one. Yeah, these are fucking easy, mate. Again, no, well, that's why you got it wrong. I knew you the did, game. No, nah, but I, you didn't oh, get it. Wow. You didn't get it. We're gonna go trade detail. Yeah. So, you didn't say VHS. You said VBS. I, we can we can check it again. We can check the camera uh-huh. again. Our next one is also a sound. Okay, cool. Right? You have to get this. I, I know you'll get it. I know you'll get it. Okay, go on. What's that sound? What the, I've heard it before. That's Windows 2000. Huh? Windows XP? That sound you just heard? Windows 2000. What sound is that? If, From the computer, nah? Yeah, what is it? When you log on... MSN! Yeah! How can I... Uh, no, no, I knew it was computer related. Okay. I didn't know what. Okay, okay, so now that... You... That's a notch, isn't it? The first one yeah, I Yeah, the notch, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. That's the notch. That's a notch, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then... I mean, when you lot were on MSN, I was, like, studying books and shit. So. Chat shit. I'd... What was your... Um, anyways, what was your... um? Uh, fucking email back in the days. You must have some cringy email. No box, Julian. <laughs> nah, nah. No box didn't. No box wasn't born back then. <coughs> no box wasn't. Can, can I guess what it was? Yeah, it was fucked. It uh, wasn't. It wasn't that bad. It was, was just it dumb. It was Hold on, UK. Is that what it was? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Who's laughing? What yeah. was yours? You know, cause in Who's Denmark. <laughs> Could have been, yeah. might as well have been. Uh, I didn't know a lot of English words, but it was yeah. cool to have English words. Oh, oh, so your first email address was in Denmark. Yeah, oh yeah, because yeah, how old were you when you? When I moved here, I yeah. was t- thirteen oh, when yeah, I came yeah, so here. So sense, obviously yeah. back then, teenager. So the only English words I knew was cool. Yeah. C double O L. Cool boy Vitagen. Yeah. Fuck off. Satya ma. How the fuck did you know? Okay, not make cool boy Vitagen. Cool boy Vitagen one two three. So cool boy Vitagen was there. Hundred percent. Cool boy Vitagen one. Yeah, and I remember. I, that was my email for a very long time. Yeah. It's only when I came to the UK I realized I got yeah. to change up my use and yeah, my yeah. email now. You know why? Because it was cringe. Because school and stuff, they would check your emails and stuff. Yeah. But sometimes you had to go to IT lessons and you have to use the email for something, right? Yeah, yeah. And then I was the only one writing it in cool boy, whatever. Yeah. That was, and I realized, okay, you can't be doing it this way. So I had to go and make my new one. You know what my one was? What? It's mad because I wasn't even like short or anything. I was average height, yeah? Yeah, or 5'10". Yeah. Nah, I was average... <laughs> 5'10". <laughs> Should we tell them the story? What? Nah, you don't want me to say Well, you know, do, you, do you know the story? Tell me your story and I'll tell you why I say 5'10". Uh, cool, cool, cool. Fun. But anyways, let me... Um, my email address, let me quickly say it. Yeah. It was little underscore Julian 007 at hotmail.co.uk. Oh, but little people say that a lot. I don't you know, know why. what? Maybe I, I, let me tell you why he what? said little. Maybe Lil Wayne? Nah, um, nah. You know why you put little? Little superstar. And you're a symbol uh, fan. Ah, maybe, you know. Maybe. That has to be it. Because you know why? How, lo- how many years ago was this? Bruv, you know why? You know why? This this might make a lot of sense. Do you know why? Because when I was in year five or something, yeah, yeah. Kadal Alvadile came out. Simba's oh yeah, that's first the first film movie, as a yeah. hero, yeah. And I still remember when I watched that film, I was gassed. I was Do like, you remember Yo. that tune? Ah, even then, that's not the wrong song. Oh, okay, okay. Little little superstar. That's not that movie. Is that from yeah. that movie? Nadandivanda style par. That's not from a movie though. That was it? the intro song, bro. That that's the oh. first bit. Yeah. So, so do you know why I keep saying I'm five foot ten, five foot ten? Yeah. I don't know what yeah. I'm actually yeah. what I actually am, you yeah, know. Yeah, but I yeah. think I'm And five. You, nah, you you say I'm you're... probably five eight or five nine. Let's be realistic, yeah, height wise. Bro, this, the reason I don't want to talk about your height on this podcast Why? Is because I don't want to embarrass you So I want to get on no. to the next topic Fuck, what? I don't want to get on to the next what? topic What? We can't nah, tell your height nah, on nah, this Nah, listen, listen, listen Listen, listen, listen uh, Okay, okay I'm going to say I'm gonna say one thing I have to I'm redeem myself I'll tell you why I'm going to say one thing I'm going to say one thing I'm not going to talk I'm not going to 
say your actual height yeah. because I, like I said I don't want to I know my listen, height you don't know your height I do you just said the I, wrong height I, I'll, I, I know what I can, no, no, can no. be listen 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 I'm not you're a, talking like you're fucking six I'm or not, something no nah, I'm not though you're not you're like you this much my, taller than me exactly you're this much exactly an inch, an inch. You okay, fucking, fine. Okay, fine. Pussy, yo. fine, fine. Listen to me. This is what's mad. The fact that I never said I was six foot. I never said I was fucking five ten either. Yeah. Then why did you rub it in my face? Huh? Why no. Did you have to rub it in my the face? whole point was because for the past like three to four years or whatever or however many years you've been going around telling everyone I'm five foot ten. I'm five foot ten. And for some reason, yeah. But let me come listen, to the story. Why? Listen, and for Fuck some, sake, and man. And for some reason, for for some reason. It never hit me to think like, oh no, he's not 5'10", because he's like a little, this much shorter than me, yeah? Even though I'm not 5'10", I'm not going to go into the heights, because again, I do not want to embarrass my guy here. You know the today. number of times you measured ourselves, yeah? yeah? Sometimes I'm taller than you, you huh? know? You're so, taller than me when you fucking wear your Tims, bro. I don't wear Tims, bro. You wear Tims okay. just so you can you be know taller what, than yeah? me, bro. You know what, are you, I'm if you're on it, if you're yeah. on it, yeah. you mean naked. <laughs> Why do you need to be naked, bro? Because then you say, oh, your jacket is showing <laughs> nah, you've nah, been taller. Nah, nah, nah. You say, oh, you're Yo, wearing long jeans. You know what? We've we've. Tested. Okay, fuck it. Okay, you're tall. Happy? You're taller than me by a fucking inch. You know what's happening? But you know, I make you it up. What? I make it Guys. up in other places. I just want to talk to the camera. You carry on talking. I just, you know what Nico does when he talks <laughs> himself? That's what I'm going to do. I just want to tell you guys. What you just saw right now is ultimate gaslighting. This is... If your boyfriend does things like this, it's a red flag. Because... He's shouting over me, one. And two, he's doing that whole thing. Oh, you know what? You're tall. Okay, fine, you're tall. I never said I was tall. This whole conversation wasn't about me being tall, Vitagen. Okay. Are you listening? But Stop can gaslighting. I, can, can I just say why yeah. I say 5'10"? Why are you say 5'10"? Right, cool, cool. I didn't say 5'10 mm -hmm. all this time because I knew I was 5'10". Don't do that, face. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm, I'll actually leave this okay, podcast. Go, 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 Fuck go, this podcast. Tell me, tell me. I'm 5'10 because yeah. once I got stopped by the police and yeah. he asked me, how tall are you? And I said, I don't know. Yeah. He looked at me and he wrote down his report, oh, 5'10. Probably about 5'10. They put like around 5'10. Yeah, so that's yeah. why I've been saying 5'10. Okay. All right, fair enough. Yeah. I understand. Yeah. So I, that's not, that's a valid reason, yeah? yeah. I get it because uh, like, uh, yeah, okay, I get it. But my thing is, what? my thing is, <laughs> That's a big post. Wait, I'm trying to think. I don't think there's a thing behind it. But what I was trying to say is that. Are you going to fucking diagnose me with a mental disorder? I already diagnosed you. <laughs> but that diagnosis is for myself. It's for me to know. Uh, go on. <laughs> okay, go on. I've diagnosed everyone. I've diagnosed myself with shitloads of things, so don't yeah, worry. Yeah, true. But you know, you know, um, in, um, I don't know if you know this theory, but you know, Vinnie the Pooh. Yeah, all, all of them have different mental All the characters have different mental health disorders, yeah? Yeah. Which one are you? Of the thing, because I know um, uh, Wait, Winnie. Let me quickly get all of them. Uh, Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh has an I'm eating disorder. Winnie the Pooh doesn't have the eat, is it? Yeah, yeah, because he's always eating honey in it, always hungry and shit. Oh shit! And then the rabbit, the yellow rabbit, always like stressed out. That's he. he um, he's got anxiety. Okay, so Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, they put a picture up of Winnie the Pooh. Suffers from what? ADD, what's ADD? I think ADD is eating disorder, no? Eating disorder. <laughs> yes, ED. ED eating ADD. disorder. What's ADD, bro? Google it. Oh, this is why we need Prodi, man. Yeah, that's why we need Prodi because Prodi could Google that shit quick time. ADD. I swear it's eating disorder. Oh, um, it's something to do. Oh, I think they mean like ADHD. No, ADHD is disorder. He's not hyper. No. Oh, binge eating disorder. Binge eating disorder. That's yeah. the one. Yeah. yeah. Right, so cool. Tigger, the tiger, Tigger, he's got ADHD. He's got ADHD. I think that's me. I think I'm Tigger. <laughs> I just... Rue. Who the fuck is Rue? Let me see. Let me see. Rue the mouse. The mouse? That's show autism. Rue's not a mouse. It's a kangaroo, bro. It's a baby kangaroo. Did you not watch Winnie the Pooh as a kid? Rue is a fucking... <laughs> <in> a mouse, <laughs> He's a I kangaroo. I, I genuinely for from, from based on this picture, I thought it was a mouse. Yeah, but you should know. Okay, just that picture. Does it look like? <laughs> so based on the game, you would have guessed that today's podcast is sort of about '90s tech and things that we miss, or things that was very different, or, and how quickly technology has changed over the last 10, 15, 20 years. '90s, early 2000s nostalgia. Yeah, and um, I want to start this off by talking about um. An experience that we don't get to have anymore, yeah. which I used to enjoy so much. Um, uh, wanking off to the Argos catalog. <laughs> <laughs> did you not do that? Do you not, do you not remember the uh, Argos catalog? I didn't. There's a massive catalog, yeah. and in the middle there was the uh, women's underwear section. 
Okay. And I had it in my room. And what did you do? I just look at it all the time. And then? That's it. That's mad, bro. Sometimes. Fuck, bro. I may have licked the pages. You're fucked. That's all I'm saying. You're fucked. It's just a horny teenager, isn't it? I was only 19. So the experience that I wanted to talk about. I was a 19, by the way. <laughs> I was young. Anyways. The experience I wanted to talk about was. Uh, <clears throat> so basically, back, back, back in the day. In my household, we were only allowed to watch a Tamil film every Friday nights, yeah? Oh, like um, like a treat? Yeah, because we're not allowed... Because basically, from a young age, my dad realized that me and my brother were too deep into Tamil movies and stuff. And he realized that we're not going to study if we keep watching these films. Yeah, you are still are now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, what, what, so because of that, we were never allowed Tamil channels. We never had Tamil channels. Oh, so um, you could only watch movies on So certain... we only used to go get movies. Okay, so, okay, so okay. Back then, the only way we could go and get those films is um, we used to go to a Tamil shop. So, but me personally, we used to, my family person, we used to go to Queensbury Cash and Curry, Marudi Cash and Curry, Marudi Cash and Curry, the one yeah. next to the station. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I still big up Marudi boss man. And it used to be the like even thinking back to it is such a sick feeling that it's like on Friday when school's finishing, you know it's movie day and stuff. Yeah. And then you go home. And then you get ready and stuff. And then my dad drives us to uh, the Tamil shop, yeah? Yeah, yeah. And then I'll, 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 it's either me or my brother. We go inside the shop. And then I re- still remember inside the shop on the wall, they'll have like a paper. And they would have printed like all the latest films they've got. And oh. they always update it. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then we'll have like all the names, like uh, whoever it was back yeah, then, yeah. bruv, yeah? Yeah, yeah? And all the names. And then, nec- and then next to it, in, in brackets, it would say like camera copy or DVD original oh, and stuff. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. they used to openly sell like... D- yeah, and it was one pound in it. Wasn't it was one, one, pound one pound to rent pound, it out. Yeah, yeah, one yeah. pound to rent it out. Back then, it was one pound to rent yeah, it out. Yeah. A few years later, it was just one pound to buy it. And the thing is, we would still buy the camera quality one. Nah, my, I, we didn't. We oh, didn't. we did, we did. Like, we did. my dad hated camera quality. You yeah. can't watch it in the public. He, nah, yeah. yeah. And I'm still like that now. Like, when people watch the dead quality movies, I can't do that. I'll tell you what, I, need... I watched one time movie, camera yeah. quality. Why is it? I couldn't be bothered about the movie. So I, yeah, I just watched it later. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nah, I, I hate watching dead quality. Um, At least the boss man was honest back in the day. So he didn't finish it. Yeah, yeah. They were, they were told the truth. And, yeah, um, yeah so... That 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 feeling of just going to the shop, going through the list, finding yeah. out that it's not out, wait for it the following week, and it's just like a whole, it's a whole, it's a but whole the, experience, isn't it? Yeah. To yeah. go watch a so film. So did you like look forward to Fridays? Yeah, yeah. Friday was like my favorite days. Yeah. Yeah. And sometimes there might have been so many films that came out that we get to watch one on Saturday. Yeah, Saturday as well. As well yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But did you have like a special time you'd watch it? Like during evening, the day or evening? Evening. Evening. Yeah, it had to be evening, innit? Evening thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Even in Denmark, um, we used to have this thing called TVM TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And TTN. Yeah. I don't know if you know. Dude. I know. I know them. We just never had them. Oh really? Mm. Okay. Yeah. But so we had them, and then yeah. we would watch. Um, there used to be a movie on every. Um, I think uh, every Friday, Saturday, they used yeah. to put a new movie, but at nine o'clock in the evening. So okay. I know that if a movie starts at nine o'clock, it finishes at 11.30. Yeah, yeah. So that used to be every Friday, Saturday, we buy a, a pack of crisps yeah, yeah. and like some drinks yeah, yeah. and we would sit there watch movie. It doesn't yeah. matter what the movie was. Yeah, but exactly. back then, there was a lot of Vikram, Ajit, Vijay yeah, movies. Vijay and, movies. Yeah, I that. remember one day they said they're going to put Red you know, Vijay, red, yeah, Ajit's yeah, red yeah. movie. Yeah. They said they're going to put that. Yes, yeah. I was gassed. I was like, are oh, you red? Bottom, 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 yeah. bottom, and stuff. Yes, I remember I got like red color um, soda <laughs> yeah yeah and red like barbecue flavor crisps yeah, yeah. all red because yeah. i want to i want to watch red yeah, now yeah. <laughs> and then uh, what happened that day yeah yeah they didn't put red movie yeah they put fucking uh thing instead what? uh within. <laughs> Probably the <one laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. i was angry yeah, yeah. but this is why i hate myself yeah i i took that anger out of my mom and dad yeah 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 i tell them off like why is it this <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. and my mom was like <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah but yeah, that movie. Oh. So yeah, like that, that's a sick experience when it comes to '90s stuff. Yeah, and like for example, these days, yeah, when it comes to birthdays or events, yeah, yeah, yeah. Most of the times, people buy each other expensive things rather than experiences, right? Mm. And like, and like next year, you might even forget what someone got you, even if it costed two hundred, three hundred. Yeah, pounds, it was an right? item. Yeah, because you, why would you? Sometimes you don't remember because you don't, you're not too interested in it. The fact that I still remember and the fact that it only cost like two pounds, yeah. Mm. So I think it was my like thirteenth or fourteenth birthday. Yeah. One of my friends from school, um, he lived near my yard. He was this Afghan boy, yeah. Yeah. And um, he, he, I just invited him. I didn't do anything for my birthday, yeah. Yeah. I was just like, oh, it's my birthday, but come over. Like my mom cooked some extra food and shit. Yeah. Like some special birthday food. And then we'll just munch and then watch a so film. So just one there. friend you had over? He, no, he, he lived near my... I, I, I was never planning to do anything that oh, day. Okay, okay. We were going to do like a family thing that weekend. Okay. But that actual day was just a weekday, innit? Oh, yeah, yeah. So I was like, oh, just come over if you want with my birthday and stuff. And then he was gassed that it's my birthday, mm. yeah? 
So he was like, oh, I'm going to surprise you, Julian, or whatever, yeah? Mm-hmm. And then um, and then he's like, oh, because basically near where we lived, there was like all these um, shops and there was Blockbuster, which doesn't exist anymore. Oh, Blockbuster. Can you explain what Blockbuster is for people? For the 2K kids watching this, yeah, Blockbuster yeah. is like a shop where you can rent out DVDs and tam- um, tam- no, English films and stuff, basically. Yeah, you rent it American out and then films. you uh, give it back to them a give week it later. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a library for movies. Yeah, library for movies. So, yeah, so he, he had a card, didn't it? A Blockbuster card. Yeah. And he was like, come, let's get and choose any film, we'll get it and stuff. Was yeah. it was, was a subscription fee? Did you have to pay monthly? No, um, I th- I don't know why he had a card. I think you needed a card or something to rent out. And you, oh, yeah, because... You was your Afghan friend's birthday on the 1st of January, by any chance? No, because he wasn't from back home, and he was born uh, here. Born but here, yeah, okay. if they're because I know there, I know a lot of Afghan boys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. some guys I'm still chill with. Their birthday is first, first of January. Of January. Even my barbers, Somalis. all of their birthdays yeah. first of January. He was like, "Oh, you didn't choose any DVD." And then we got Shaolin Soccer. Have you ever seen that film? Shaolin Soccer. Shaolin Soccer. Oh, the Kung Fu uh, football movie. Yeah, yeah. Mad movie, bro. So he brought it, and then we watched it, and I was so gassed. Yeah, I was like, "This film is sick." Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Football with the karate and shit. And then I remember I looked. Um, I remember fi- trying to figure out who the director was. I think it's Stephen Chow or something. Yeah. Yeah. And then I looked into all the films he leave that. I looked into all the films he made. Yeah, he yeah. made Kung Fu Hustle One, Two, and oh, all Kung that. Fu Hustle was him. Yeah, yeah, no yeah. Way. Kung Fu Hustle One, Two, and he made this film called Something Kitchen, where but it was about a chef. It's comedy film or something as yeah, well. Yeah. yeah, a lot of things back then was like uh, the experience was the best part. Experience, the experience of, yeah. of getting that film. Mm-hmm. The experience of going somewhere with your friends and looking through a list of yeah, movies yeah, yeah, and yeah. buying it. And now everything's just like Netflix, Amazon Prime. You just sit there and it's like... That's like if someone asked YouTube. me, for example, yeah, would you have like a 500... Would, would you rather have a new iPhone for your birthday or would you want to go to the beach with all your friends and yeah. have a barbecue? Yeah. I'd probably choose the barbecue. Yeah, I'd choose the iPhone, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, if you want to go France or like you want to go to a different country yeah. by car, yeah. you think about so many things, right? Like, or petrol, diesel, uh, it has the car got enough oil. Congestion charge. Congestion charge. We don't need congestion charge. To go where? To go France. Oh, yeah, you don't. So, <laughs> yeah. I forgot to go France. Up north, nah, yeah, nah. Yeah, oh, yeah. through central, nah, yeah, nah. Yeah, yeah. Now, but you think about all these things before yeah. you get in a car. Back yeah. in the days, our dads would have the shittiest car. Yeah, yeah. But that car would take us anywhere. across yeah, Europe, yeah, yeah. anywhere. Yeah. So we used to do that. And then, remember, they used to have them old school cassette players, mm. yeah? And then you put the cassette in. And then the first two hours of the journey, calm. You yeah. think about this, yeah? You have a 12 hour journey. Yeah. So we used to go to Switzerland quite a lot. We used yeah, to yeah. drive there. Give me one second. You're going to pick up. When mom calls, you're always going to pick up. You always have to pick up, rather. Sorry. Stop. Hold on. Let me pull up real quick. Julian. You know, Julian's mom calls hey, him hey. Julia. No, she no, doesn't. Julie Kuti. Yeah, Julie Kuti. Nah. She does. Wait. Once I went to his house wait, here, wait, 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 and me and him were chilling upstairs in the room, and the mom is from downstairs. She was like, Julie Kuti. <laughs> <laughs> the way she started, Julia. <laughs> yeah. uh, she said, Julie Kuti. <laughs> nah. Yeah, so um, the first, uh, when we used to go on these trips, we used to yeah. have one cassette tape with us, innit? We wouldn't yeah, think about it. Now tape. we would plan a whole playlist. Playlist. And we have Spotify, unlimited, yeah. innit? Yeah. Back then, not just one same cassette, cassette tape. And I think my dad must have forgot to take his yeah. cassette tapes with yeah. him. So he had one cassette, yeah. yeah. And it was some MGR song. Yeah, Back yeah. in the day, Sivaji, yeah. MGR, old school song. Yeah. Yeah. First, one hour, fine. Yeah. But when that seed, uh, when that cassette finished playing and mm. it goes back, loop back to the same song, yeah, I kid you not, we listened to the same 10 songs at least 60, 70 times yeah, yeah, before yeah, we got yeah. to our destination. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's another example but of then, um, how you had to force yourself to listen to these songs. Whereas now, you Spotify can just play any song change and stuff. anything, man. But then, but then also back then, yeah, yeah, we never used to skip songs because we only had 10 songs, yeah. But now, oh, yeah. don't you also feel like you're just skipping through everything, looking for a song that shuffle, you don't shuffle, know what shuffle, you're looking shuffle, for? Shuffle, 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 yeah, quick. You're just always yeah. like, oh, nah, I don't want this. I don't nah, want this. Nah, I don't nah, want nah. this. What just songs? Skip. What songs do you listen to when you're driving? Now, say you're on a mission. Say you're single and you're going to meet a girl for the first time. You got fresh. Trim I don't. And I don't have songs depending on the situation. I don't play whatever's what I'm, what I'm about to do in my life. Okay, so say you're. For my dailies, yeah. like average, usually what I put is either UK rap yeah. or just like a Tamil playlist. Tamil playlist. But I don't I have think, a specific think, Tamil playlist. Oh yeah, if you guys want to follow Julian's playlist, what's it called? No Box. I've got the 90s, No Box 90s. No Box 90s. Banger. It's ni- Banger, oh, yeah. It's to do with today's topic, 90s tracks, 90s, 90s Oh spec. shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. So follow that if you guys want. I remember the whole start, you're starting from the cassette thing, yeah? Yeah. From there, literally the next stage was... um. Okay, the, the one you're talking about is when there's only 10 songs, yeah? Yeah. Literally, what's the, what do you think the next improvement was? 
from there, the, uh, what was the next? Audio CDs. Huh? CDs? Okay, CDs, yeah. yeah. CDs. Uh, and even in CDs, if you go, if you had like two movie songs. There'd be like two movies, like, I don't know, yeah, Kada, yeah. Lali, Wadili, and yeah, Friends or whatever. Movies, yeah, two yeah. movies. What was the step after that? Uh, Blu-ray? No, Blu-ray was movies. <laughs> movies, yeah, yeah. Uh, you had, um, are you talking about songs? Yeah, when it comes to cars and music. Uh, we started getting in our phone now. No, no, no. So b- before, okay, we, we just said the two movies, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then the next step I still remember was um, when... This is when I was, I, I think I must have started driving, yeah? And I didn't have, uh, obviously, first car. You don't have a decent car and shit, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So I didn't have the new stuff and shit. Oh, so like you're not a proper stereo. Yeah, yeah so yeah. when you go to the Tamil shop, yeah? yeah. At this point, what? What's that? <laughs> they would have uh, a mixture of songs. And uh, they would have 100 songs. 100 songs, yeah, yeah. yeah. I used and to be gassed about that because yeah, you don't know what's going to come But remember, up. there was a difference as well. There used to be something called audio CD and there was something called MP3 CD. Yeah, yeah, MP3 yeah. MP3 was when you could have more songs. And that's what you needed for your card mainly. Yeah, now. for your yeah, car. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my day. I remember when you get in the car and you fit it because you used to take the stereo out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you put it back in. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah, yeah. whenever I used to park the car up, yeah. yeah. My my when I started driving back in 2012, yeah. like um, that's when the stereos was just getting yeah. old. And you used to take it and take it and after put it in my pocket because you don't want people to so steal I had it. Keys, the stereo, <laughs> everything in my pocket. I can't believe that was a thing, you know, yeah. like taking it off. Now you just fucking walk off in it. You leave it. And now that's people what... used to thief those things. They used to steal yeah, those things, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They would break windows just to get the fucking stereo out. And that's why it was important to take it back to your house or yeah. take it with you. Yeah, and that's why that's when you had the USB port in there where yeah. you could put the USB, load up yeah, the songs, yeah, yeah. and stick it. So in. that's the next step after oh, CD. Mate. Uh, I miss those days, you know. And then after USB, it was then we started getting like. Um, yeah, I think straight after that, it must have been Bluetooth and all that, innit? Uh, what do you mean? Aux cable came. Aux cable came, What was yeah. after... Um, oh, in order to listen to it in the yes, car? The, yeah, in the car. In the car so okay. there was a USB was the next step after CDs. Yeah, and then, then it was Aux. Aux cable, because you could download it on your phone. On your phone. And then listen to and it And then Bluetooth phone. came. Then, and now you have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto and everything. all those things, yeah. Fuck it. What could yeah. even be next after this? No, no, but... Well, you know, um, you know you can watch movies in your car. <laughs> yeah, really shit, but yeah. <laughs> what do you mean shit? The like quality. a small screen. No, the yep. quality is calm, but yeah, it's but bare small. A small, yeah, yeah. But you know you can watch movies in your yeah. car, yeah. But you know once you start driving your car, yeah. it turns off, innit? Yeah, 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 for safety reasons. Yeah. The other day, yeah, I was just chilling in traffic, yeah. I swear to God, yeah, this guy in a brand new BMW yeah. watching a movie on his yeah. screen as he's driving. Oh, shit. And I'm thinking maybe it's just like a little thing, yeah. That's I keep my looking, yeah. No? Yeah, but it's some people like to listen to things Listening and watch okay, things as well. Yeah. But if you're stuck in traffic... Yeah, why, yeah. why not whack up an still. episode of Friends or whatever? Yeah. yeah. Well, that's mad. You didn't know about your car had video thing in it for a I long while. I didn't even know for like... I had it for, I had the car for a year and I found out after a year. Because I was just saw this thing that said video and I was like, what? And I was like... I saw this... I always knew there was a CD thing yeah, in there. Yeah. But I never knew it was for Is movies. Is it in the boot? It's in the boot. No, no. It's right there. Like oh, the okay. Front. I didn't know it was a vi- and then I, video. It's got a thing to put a DVD in it. Oh, and I, for some reason, I thought it was just to play CDs like oh, music shit. or something. So then I went home got Scarface, put it in, and it just started working. You must have been bare gassed, gassed, didn't it? It's funny because I was gassed that moment, but ever since then, I've never used you it used to it, watch yeah, anything. Because yeah. I remember you showed us a video of it in the group yeah. chat, and I was <laughs> like, oh shit, that's mad. Uh. But yeah, um, so yeah, the MP3 players are a good type. Oh, i got a question for you. Go on. Um, back in the day, do you remember LimeWire? Was that not one of them dodgy websites where you can Lime download where you can illegal download website, illegal where you download illegal, music yeah. and movies illegally? Do you remember? Do you did you use it? I didn't use LimeWire, but I know it's the it's basically the logo of a lime, isn't it? Like lime, lime green cut in half, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, no, no. So I used to think LimeWire is what's now the new Wait, so Spotify. What, what did you use to download shit? Oh, torrent websites, kickass torrents. Oh, yeah. LimeWire is torrent. a torrent kind of thing, no? I think so. Yeah, I think yeah. so. Yeah, yeah. And you have to do the, the, the whole seeds shit. Yeah, seeds. What, is, what did you know that thing? I never I, understood I, I, what it meant. I, me neither. But the thing is, the I higher the seeds, along with the quicker it. the download was. So I think if someone downloaded more from one ex- specific file, the more seeds it got. So more quicker it is. Yeah, I think so. And also, that means that the, uh, uh, I never understood. It's like a mega upload. You know mega upload? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that yeah, was like yeah, a dodgy yeah, yeah. website as well. Mega guy, upload was and the... the guy's in prison now, isn't it? The guy who came up with uh, the I inventor. remember something like that. Yeah. Because people started misusing it for... Uh, obviously, there's piracy. Obviously, yeah, piracy yeah. is always a massive Fuck, thing. Mega upload. It was, it was it orange. Why do I... Have, for some reason... Yeah, I'm it's orange. orange. It was mega and upload in grey. And you so yeah. if you wanted to go and download a movie, yeah, yeah. it would take you to that website yeah, that and website. you download it from yeah. there. Bro, I remember, yeah, sometimes even music on LimeWire yeah. used to take like two, three hours for one song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, what is it like? 
two seconds, easy, easy work, man. Yeah, it used to be a two. You know, it's funny. We have something to compare to, because we grew up in that era yeah. where it was started. Yeah, and we're now at the era where it, it possibly can't get. It probably will get better yeah. than this, but it, we think that it's not gonna get better. So we've lived in both, and we're like. Do you remember uh, when um, if you tried to download a movie, yeah? Yeah. You sometimes have to leave it overnight and it could take like two days to download. Oh, the yeah, because, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you ever make your own DVDs and shit? Yeah, I used to do that. Covers, print it out. Yeah, I didn't do it. I didn't go to that extent of printing I it out. But, so you you probably were, did the CDs, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to do is um get the VHS. So it would, the movie, so yeah. people who couldn't afford DBOM TV and yeah. TTN, yeah? So if I knew this movie was going on at nine o'clock, yeah. I put a cassette tape. Oh, in, you record it, I record yeah, yeah. it onto the cassette, yeah. Yeah. and then I'd get like a white sticker background, stick yeah, it on, yeah, and yeah. I would do my own artwork. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah, what yeah. I used yeah, to do, yeah, and I used yeah. to have like like yeah. 10, 15 of those. Yeah, yeah. And then people who don't have whatever, yeah, uh, they would just come and um, yeah, yeah. borrow it from us. Yeah. Now oh. we used to do, we used to do that, but you know our brains back then in the UK, you know what we thought about doing back yeah. then? That's what Tamilangas are doing now. I mean. I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm saying now, but I'm just saying that the idea <laughs> yeah. of ripping a movie off yeah. and make 10, 15 copies yeah. and then selling it for a pound. Yeah. That must have been a mad idea. My dad used to do that. Uh, is it? So your dad is the reason why Michelle is out there <laughs> fucking trying to get people. <laughs> Sorry, Michel. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. Do you know you always ask me like, oh, why am I so much into Tamil films and stuff? Yeah, exactly. This is the reason. Your dad was ripping off. <laughs> it was doing some illegal things and stuff, yeah. Basically, yeah. let me tell you. My dad had a Tamil shop back in France. The first Tamil shop in the area, yeah? So Tamil, gro- like grocery, I Grocery think. kind of oh, store. No and we st- it was the first in the area. You should have carried on a legacy and opened one here, you know? <laughs> I'm not interested. Julian Cash and Carry. <laughs> so he had that shop. Yeah. And we used to sell Tamil movies and stuff. Okay. And basically, in, na- in our shop, we had like a basement, right? Oh, yeah. And we walked down this... St- <laughs> it wasn't dodgy or anything. We walked down these stairs. Okay. And my dad had five different cassette, uh, tape players, cassette players. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then w- when a new film comes out, yeah. he plays it and presses record and all five will get recorded at the oh, same time. Oh, so he makes five CDs Five now. CDs. Then he plays the film again and he makes another five. Oh, shit. And what am I doing after school? Watching that film twice in a row, yeah? And next thing you know, I'm starting to analyze this film. Next thing you know, <laughs> I'm fucking loving this film, yeah. <laughs> and then I'm becoming. That's how you got into it. That's then. how I got. That's oh, how we all got shit. into. Like we, I'm so into Tamil films. It's because since I was a kid, what did I fucking do after school? Come downstairs and watch a film three times because but, it's but, playing but again. But do you also not think that we, the reason why we were so into Tamil movies and stuff because obviously the protagonist, the hero in the yeah. movies. He looked a lot. He didn't look like us, but we knew that when we Probably grew up, we can relate to him. We can relate to yeah, him. Yeah, that's yeah. the right word for it. That, yeah. that we can relate to them. Because yeah. obviously, I can't relate to Superman or anything like that. Yeah. Did it get to a point where your dad would handle the business upstairs, and then you would be downstairs and doing the movie bit? Uh, or was I, that also him doing that? I, no, I think he would just play and then come upstairs. He would oh, okay, leave it okay. to record. Look, I thought stuff. he'd employed you as the little mini man downstairs. <laughs> nah, nah. The... You know now when I think about it, yeah? He probably did, but he didn't nah, nah, like, That's mad illegal, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's mad illegal. We were doing some Julian dodgy Julian and business. his dad invented <laughs> piracy. <laughs> we were doing some mad dodgy ass business back then. Mad. No, don't do feel you know too what? hard. Do you know, it's normal. Uh, it's normal. Do you know what? Do you know what? What you know? Ninety eight World Cup final was France versus Brazil. Yeah. Ninety eight. Yeah. I don't watch football. Basically, but this was like one of the best days of my life in France. And if you watch football, you know why it was the best day of mm-hmm. my life. France versus Brazil World Cup final. I'm living in France at this point. Yeah. And we're all watching it in like a family friends house because everyone got together yeah, and yeah, we yeah. like celebrating it. Yeah? yeah. Yeah. But obviously, my dad's got this shop and. Do you know Tamil people? They never close their shops, yeah, no, because no, no. this is the day where you make the most money. Yeah, if of anything. course, of course. So he had to keep it open, yeah. But he's bare into football as well, so he's watching on his TV. All I remember, yeah, is two days later, I come to the shop, and there's bare cassettes, yeah, of France versus Brazil. My guys printed the covers <laughs> and he starts selling them. I'm just looking back at. Where are people buying that though? People, because it's memories and it's the World Cup final. Oh, oh, it's the World Cup final. Yo, that's where you get your business brain from, you know, from your dad. Yo. So, but well, people actually buying these cassettes from your dad? Yeah, yeah, it was it was a thing, bro. Like people wanted it as a memory, and it just oh, like I was, um, oh, that's like when people used to buy the newspaper, for example, for like to keep as memory or something, yeah, yeah, right? Keep as memory and stuff. Yeah. So like when Brexit happened, people yeah. bought the paper on the day. When someone from the royal family got married, mm. they bought the paper on the day. I used to find it weird, but I see why. Because imagine fifty years later, you're going through your stuff, 
and then you go through your old porn magazines yeah. and your old and then you find this newspaper and you're like oh shit this is when petrol used to be yeah, this yeah. price this is when brexit happened all that stuff innit? and the thing is some people like to watch old like classic football games and shit oh yeah, yeah, yeah. so like france versus brazil and we won three nil it was like a big deal back then yeah, so yeah some people want to look back at it and watch the whole match and shit yeah so yeah so he did so bro he so, made money from recording <laughs> illegally <laughs> yeah. Sure, and your dad did some illegal <laughs> stuff, you know. <laughs> did you ever carry on? Mm. You know your dad yeah. was the Tamil Pablo Escobar. <laughs> <laughs> he was. Instead of killing people yeah. who are living and yeah. like uh, ruining other people's yeah, lives. Yeah. Okay, not Pablo Escobar. Robin Hood. Robin Hood. Robin Hood. <laughs> your dad was Robin Hood. Robin Hood. You know what? Like I've been saying the word illegal and saying all these things with my dad. I kind of feel bad right now, yeah, because. This was. I just want to explain. You this know, it's a, normal. It's normal. Everyone used if to do you it. Had, if you had a Tamil shop and if Everyone you didn't do, do it. If actually, if you didn't, if you had a Tamil shop and if you didn't do that, you're a waste man. Why'd you have a shop? Why'd you have a business? Yeah, because sometimes people can't afford it. So they, they rely on that one cassette tape. Yeah, why don't you want to help your community? Okay, no, it all depends though. What price did your dad sell them at? Oh, it was standard, bro. That one, it was wherever it was, like in Tamil Two shops, euros, one three pound euros. Whatever. Uh, okay. One yeah, frank. I, I don't know how much it was, but did you not have CCTV back in the days? In your no, 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 that was a new thing, nah, isn't it? Nah. Yeah, because even Tam- Tamil shops don't need CCTVs. Tamil dads and Tamil uh, aunties, aunties are ruthless. CCTV. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah. ruthless, bro. Yeah, yeah. Have you seen videos of these Tamil aunties like where so guys go in curry powder? Yeah, yeah. 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 curry powder. Yeah, yeah. Or like the uh, men, it will be the tiniest little thing, yeah, yeah. but they're ready to fight. They'll come yeah, out yeah. and fight like these five, six people. Yeah. Now, I I remember um, when I used to work in a petrol station. Yeah, my boss used to tell me, yeah, um, if someone steals, don't chase after don't them, bother, don't do anything, yeah. yeah. And he was a good boss, didn't it? So yeah. I was like, oh, that's nice of him, yeah. yeah. But you, you, when you're in the moment, yeah, and yeah. someone steals off you, yeah. so one guy stole like bare meat, like yeah, yeah. frozen meat and stuff. Yeah. He stole it, yeah. And then he just ran off, yeah? yeah. And then I was like, for fuck's sake! He looked at me and he's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what pissed me off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I started chasing him. Yeah. Then he fell over. Yeah. And then after he falls over, what do I do? All his fucking homeless friends are there with him. <laughs> yeah. And I fuck it, take it and go in it. And then what happened? That's it. That's it. And then uh, my boss comes back and he goes, "Vido, you, you should have never, you should never chase them." Yeah. Because that's true. Uh, there's uh, been unless, stories. Unless it's your business, I don't think there's any point, man. Now, but if even if it's your business, there should be some sort of insurance scheme where you can get your money back. Or yeah, something. yeah. It's petrol especially state. these days, it's yeah. not worth it. Nah, it's Someone's not worth gonna it. stab you, bro. Someone will stab you of anything. Yeah. Even like I don't like him, um, like. Like my missus, my wife always tells me, yeah, that I seem like the guy who don't like um, fighting and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I actually yeah. hate fighting. Yeah. I always, like, I hate all those crap yeah, yeah. thingies. But you're not th- a fighter. You're a I'm, lover. I'm not a fighter. I'm a lover, basically. Yeah. yeah. But there's been situations, yeah, where you just want to knock someone and punch. Yeah. And then just move on with your life. Yeah. But I can't do it. Yeah. I'm not a violent person. Because you don't at know all. what it can lead to. Yeah. Exactly. I and always is it think worth of, it? I always think about the bigger picture yeah. and stuff. But yeah, that's nothing to do with childhood. Just a little um, <laughs> yeah, diversion. Yeah. But did you... Um, oh, t- speaking about childhood, yeah. Uh, w- you know the country, Greenland? Mm. So in Denmark, mm. I think Denmark colonizes, colonized Greenland yeah. many years ago. So they still own uh, uh, Greenland as part of their island. Yeah. So a lot of people from Greenland used to come to Denmark. Okay. So they were basically like... They look very... They look like Asian people. Yeah, yeah. But... Not Asian, you know Eskimos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They yeah. look like that basically, mm. didn't it? They used to come to Denmark and stuff. So we had one guy in my kindergarten mm. called Nikolai, mm. another <laughs> guy, two other guys, yeah. And we were just we were the best friends at three musketeers basically. One Tamil guy, yeah. one Greenland guy, and one Danish guy. Shit, multicultural. Multicultural group. as fuck, bro. Yeah. And then we were thinking one day, yeah, we need mm. to come up with the worst swear word. Yeah, yeah. And the only swear word I knew back then, yeah, like a foreign swear yeah. word was fuck you. Yeah, yeah. So we were like, we have to use these words. We have to come up with the worst one, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then one guy was like, fuck you, bitch. And one yeah. guy was like, fuck your mom and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. You know what I did? Yeah. I came up with the best one. Yeah. I would th- hold my mic, please, for a minute. I would hold my hands up like this. Yeah. And then I'll spit. And I'll be like, fuck you. <laughs> you're a dickhead. And we did that to the teachers, isn't it? Huh? Yeah. And then that day, obviously, you're so dumb as a you kid. You spat at the teacher. Yeah. And because that was my way of saying fuck you to the teacher. Yeah, but why? Why? What did Because they do I'm to you? stupid. I'm surrounded by bad people. Kids. <laughs> I'm a kid surrounded by kids. But <laughs> bad my, du- my dumb brain, yeah, yeah, don't realize that my dad has to come and pick me up after school, isn't it? Yeah. And then he comes and. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fuck's sake. <coughs> my dad comes and then obviously I'm sitting there and then teacher explains to my dad and my yeah. dad my dad's like confused like how the fuck do you know this yeah, yeah, yeah. how do you know how to do this yeah. and why are you spitting at yeah, teachers yeah. and stuff like that because the thing is like this, the thing is at home no Tamil par- no parents are teaching you 
Fuck you, Jay. Where are you learning this no, shit from? No, but you know what it is, yeah? Because we wanted to be as degrading as possible, nah, yeah? You and know how me, bad that is? Yeah, but my brain went there. Bro. And you know, I was only like six or seven yeah. years old. If your dad, yeah, yeah. S- not just heard, but saw what you did through a camera or something, yeah? Oh, yeah. If, well, if I was your dad, and if I, okay, if I have a kid, and if I see my son in a school, yes, through daddy. a camera, yeah, daddy. doing that, yeah? Yeah. No joke. I would get vexed, bro. I would get pissed. But you know what's funny, yeah? My dad didn't hit me. Did you ever get hit as a child? My mom here and there, but I'm not going to lie. Compared to a lot of stories I hear from Tamil kids, it? I never got beaten this, like I that. I don't get it, yeah? You know when people yeah. say, yeah? Oh, my mom burned me with a fucking yeah. metal spoon. I'm like... Yeah, you hear some mad yeah, stories, bro. And I was bro. like, what? And then... Did I, I, I remember once... Um, and the belt. The belt. Never I remember this my one life. time. One yeah. time in... Uh, uh, this Tamil girl had a uh, th- this girl had a fucking nose broken a bit, yeah. Okay. And I thought she was always like that, yeah. I thought it's like genetics or saying, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? I thought it was just a bent nose, bro, yeah. I mean, it's calm. It's just the shape, isn't it? I thought it was just a nose, yeah. <laughs> so her nose was like this. A bit bent. I thought it's just genetics, yeah. And then <laughs> you noticed that. And nose then though. a year later, she told us a story that um, uh, her mom caught her like talking to some guy or some shit. And got so vexed that she threw the iron box on her face. Iron box? Yeah, just threw it on her but face. But do you not see that could kill your child? But what kind of child yeah. abuse? Because I, I do not remember ever getting nah, hit nah. by my dad. The one time I got hit by my dad, mm. it wasn't even hit. Mm. He took a belt and he went hit, to hit next me, to but he hit the wall purposely yeah, 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 just yeah. to scare me. Yeah. And my mom, she does it like yeah, them yeah. ones. Isn't it? Like, you know how cats go like... You know, you know them kids that like... You, let's say you're Nasdaq or something, you're walking... You're shopping and stuff, yeah. I don't shop as I do waitress. No, you don't do waitress, you do little. But <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't even try it. Yeah. But Sorry, guys. There's I'm nothing like wrong with little, little Aldi. Yeah, little and Aldi is yeah. where we have to shop with the cost of living crisis and stuff. Yeah, anyways. But um, main thing what I was saying, you know, when you go as though wherever, yeah, wherever you're shopping, yeah. there's that one kid walking past, yeah, you don't even know the kid, and he's just staring at you, yeah. He does them faces, and <laughs> oh, like, shit. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get them random Do you kids. get it when you're driving and the kid's in the back seat oh, no, and the kid's like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what do you do? Bro, oh, I'm getting vexed <laughs> now, but you know, it. You know what, yeah? That shouldn't get you angry. Why, Why are you getting pissed not, off? Bro, I can't stand kids <laughs> like that, bro. I you can't. know, that was me. I was that but kid. But that's what I'm saying. You were a dickhead kid. You know, we, we used to live in Even flats. Even when you said in weddings, you're that kid running around. Yeah, I'm already me. pissed. I don't like But let kids. kid be kids, man. That's true. That's Just because you're a fucking metro <laughs> piece of shit, it's not my fucking fault. <laughs> but yeah, but you know, every single nightmare you have about kids and you don't want them to turn out yeah. like that, I was that kid. Yeah, I can imagine. I can fully picture it. You, you know, we, what we used to do, I mean, once my dad and my mom went to the supermarket because um, we were going to a, to a beach, innit? We yeah. were going to the beach and then they went shopping, like grocery shopping and barbecue shopping so we can yeah. take the stuff to the uh, beach. So my dad must have got a case of beers yeah. from beforehand and he yeah. put it in the middle of the seat in the back. Yeah. My sister here and here. And in, in Denmark, you can leave the children in the car. It doesn't matter, yeah, yeah, innit? Yeah, yeah. And obviously, windows roll down. Yeah. It's safe as fuck. No yeah. one cares. And you know what I did, yeah? yeah? I took one beer bowl and I put it out the window and it went smash. And then the kid in the next car was yeah. like, do one more. <laughs> and I like, cool. One more. Is it a random kid? Yeah, random kid. <laughs> parked next to us. <laughs> Kept, and then we're doing it. Next thing you know, we went through like 24 bottles because they're yeah, a massive yeah. case of beer in it. <laughs> and then my mom and dad come back yeah. to all the beers gone. What do you do after that? What do you do to children like that? That was me. How old were you? I'm telling you, I was six or seven years old. Five, six, you, seven. So you got a brain, bro. I have a brain. I knew that I shouldn't do it, but I still You're did You're not it. like two or three guys so i'm enjoying this episode man but i have stories for life man trust me when it comes to like 90s stuff 90s yeah bare funny stories bare. Yeah. Uh, i think it's a good episode today yeah, yeah. and hopefully we uh, were able to uh, get into your brains and uh re-emerge uh no sorry how do you say it <laughs> why um, are you trying to get into their brains okay, bro? no, no. hopefully this was a very nostalgic yeah, yeah episode ex- for you guys yeah reminded you probably a lot of your childhood as well mm-hmm. you know there's stories for life when it comes to me and i feel like the more i open up about my yeah. child stories the more you're gonna hate you're gonna, me yeah and uh, yeah, that's true that's yeah. true you know he's always said i have this punchable face yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 easily yeah but that's another podcast anyways but yeah. i think we've so done we, work we, we've, we've spoken about quite a few 90s tech kind of things yeah. and random like, let us know if you went to blockbusters yeah, I don't know if Tamil kids in the UK went to blockbusters here. Or, or drop um in the comment section. Let us know what other nineties kind of things that you miss, maybe. Yeah. Like MSN, those kind of things, or experiences like we mentioned at the start, going to the shop, getting a DVD and all that. Remember before Facebook, we had all these social media platforms. 
Bebo, Bebo High Five, High Five, MySpace. MySpace. However, Let's do another episode on that. We'll do another episode on that. Yeah. Because we, we can do the episode where I remember where uh, you got groomed by a pedophile. That's, again, that's never happened. Oh. That's never happened. However, we'll use that for a trailer. For a trailer. We'll use that for a trailer. Yeah. Oh, okay, for a trailer, yeah? So when you went on to High Five, that social media platform back yeah. in the days, um, did you know he was 45 years old? I shouldn't laugh. No, that's me being sad, bro. Oh, you being sad? Yeah. Okay, fuck it. Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And um, yeah. Catch you on the next episode.